Welcome back to the channel guys. Today we've got a quick how-to video. We're going to bind our FR Sky XM Plus up to our Tango 2 or any other OpenTX radio. Alright, we're going to make sure that we have our receiver wired up correctly on the quad. Uh, we're going to wire it to an S-Bus pad. Uh, that should be inverted there because uh, the D16 protocol on the XM Plus is inverted. Once we have confirmed that we got it wired correctly, we're going to go ahead and hold down the bind button on the receiver. The XM Plus do not automatically go into bind mode. We're going to go ahead and hold that down and then we're going to plug in a light bulb. All right, as you can see, the green light and the red light are now on. You're gonna grab your transmitter of choice. We're using an OpenTX radio, the Tango 2. You're gonna go ahead and scroll down into the setup menu. Make sure we have D16 mode selected. We're gonna click the bind button. The XM Plus does not have telemetry, so we're gonna select telemetry off and as you see the red light is flash blinking fast blinking go ahead and click the button one more time now we should be able to unplug the quad and then we're going to plug it back in All right, as you can see, we do have a green light on our receiver, and that means that our receiver is bound to our transmitter. Go ahead and check our configuration here. So we'll go into the ports tab first. We've got UR2, selected as Serial Rx, which is correct. We're gonna go ahead and go into our configuration tab. It is set to serial based receiver, which is correct, and S bus, which will work for our XM Plus. We're going to go ahead and go into our receiver tab. Make sure that your channel map is set correctly. All right, and let's just double check. Make sure everything is working, our stick movements. And as you can tell, AUX 12, I uh, have the firmware for RSSI, so we're getting our RSSI feed on AUX 12. So uh, in Betaflight, you want to make sure that you select AUX 12 for your RSSI. You can go ahead and save that. Hope this video was helpful, guys. Thanks again for tuning in. Subscribe if you're not already, and we'll catch you in the next one.